All right, folks, I'm about to do something crazy. My neighbor called me up and said that she got stung by some bees and wanted to know if I could take care of them for her. Well, I went out there to do a little reconnaissance a while ago, and there's a big, giant nest of paper wasps. Well, it's the cover photo on this video. And I'm getting ready to go and deal with them. I'm going to war. And I'm putting on my insulated blue jeans that I usually wear in the middle of January up here in Wisconsin. I'm going to grab a leather coat. I might even wear my snowmobile helmet or my derby helmet as I'm doing it. And I'm going to do my best to document it because I'm taking you with me. I've been told that bee spray is probably a complete waste of time. That's all we got. So. That will be our, our our artillery for this attack. And I'm putting on my bulletproof armor, at least why as I hope it's bulletproof, right now. Might I die of heat stroke before I actually complete this operation? Maybe, because it's kind of hot up here and I'm sweating already. This, by the way, will be the kind of attitude that will be required should a conflict ever break out in this country. Just go for it. Do what you got to do. And hopefully you made a, at least a half-assed plan before you went out to do it. And bear this in mind. There ain't no panty waste left lean and liberal out there that's going to do, or volunteer to do, what I'm about to do. It ain't going to happen. So come along with me, and let's do what needs to be done. I'm not going to wear the helmet, even though I probably should. But I'm definitely going to wear my glasses. Because I'd really rather not get stung in the eyeball. So here we go, past the Buick. Oh, I gotta show you this. I got my shoelaces tied around my pant legs, so just in case things get real bad, I ain't gonna get stung in the nuts. All right, first, we got the wasp eliminator. Let's test fire it, oh yeah. And I got to get the angle just right because there's the bees nest right there it's a big salma gun and there's only one way in and out at least because I kind of hope there's only one way in and out because I'm gonna snag the bottom of it and I'm gonna just load it you ready here we go Ain't seen him yet. Might as well hit him again, right? And away we go. They ain't on me, but who knows? They ain't right behind me. This is what you do when you go to war, ladies and gentlemen. You do what you gotta do. And hope it's enough to get the job done. <laughs> 